Today, we are going to be naming the ionic compound Al4C3. Now we have two elements here. We have aluminum, which is Al, and then we have carbon, which is C. Let's map them out on the periodic table just to see what they are. Now, aluminum is over here on the periodic table. Now, it is a metal because it is to the left of the staircase. There's a staircase on the periodic table, and all elements to the left of that staircase are metals, right? And aluminum is a metal, except for hydrogen, okay? So that's the only one that's a non-metal to the left of this staircase idea. So aluminum is a metal, okay? That goes in blue. And then carbon, which is over here, it's to the right of the staircase. So that's going to be a non-metal. Anything to the right of the staircase is a non-metal, and carbon is always going to be a non-metal. So now we have them, you know, identified what they are. Let's name them. The metal name is always going to stay the same. So aluminum is aluminum on the periodic table, so I'm just going to write aluminum. So aluminum, okay? And then C for carbon, that's the non-metal. The non-metal always gets the I-D-E ending. So it was carbon, but now I have to change it to carbide. You have to drop the O-N and add that I-D-E to get that I-D-E ending. And that's it. So Al4C3 is just aluminum carbide. Now, just make sure, guys, right? Do we really need a Roman numeral for aluminum? Well, even though aluminum is a post-transitional metal, and it's a transitional metal, aluminum only has one charge. It's always going to be a plus three. So since we don't have to, you know, name different charges, aluminum never needs a Roman numeral in the middle. So you're good. So this is just aluminum carbide. Let me know if this helped, guys, okay? Love helping you guys out in your chem classes. We also have physics and math at the moment. So you could check the channel out to just see, you know, if we could help you in other subjects. You know, tell your friends, tell your classmates. And thank you so much. All right. I hope you have a great day. See you later.